Hey guys, we're here in Costa Rica. We've been able to uh, share about Christ and our faith, um, things that God has done in our lives and about forgiveness. So I just want to share this verse out of Ephesians with you. It's Ephesians 4 and it starts in 31. It says, Let all bitterness and wrath and anger, clamor and slander be put away from you, along with all malice. Be, be kind to one another, tenderhearted, forgiving one another as God in Christ forgave you. Um, so basically, when we don't forgive, when we can't forgive, A, we're called to forgive as, as believers, but when you don't forgive someone, like someone's hurt you, you end up in a place where you become a slave to bitterness. You become hateful, and in your heart, you, you may have been forgiven by Christ, and maybe your sins are, are washed away, but there's a bitterness inside you that, that basically causes sin in your heart daily because you can't be free from something that you haven't freed someone from. And yeah, maybe they have something, that, uh, you know, a legal um, responsibility to pay for what they've done. But unless we forgive, unless we let go of, of things that people have done to us, how can God forgive us? You know, we're called to forgive as He forgave us. So I want to encourage you, be free today. I encourage you to just to let go of the hate you have for somebody. If someone's hurt you or wronged you, forgiving them is the first step to healing for you. So if there's anything you can remember from that today, it's just, if you wanna be free, you have to let go of what people have done to you and forgive them so that you can, in Christ, be free from hatred and, and come into a place of just peace with Christ, with your walk with the Lord, with what's been done to you.